Kiev says it's ready to accept the humanitarian aid being sent from Russia after Moscow agreed to a Ukrainian presence in the convoy. Officials in Kiev earlier refused to let Russian trucks cross the border, demanding the cargo be reloaded onto different vehicles. It's because Kiev suspected Moscow of using the relief mission as a cover to smuggle arms to anti-government forces in eastern Ukraine. It backtracked after Russia agreed to let representatives of the Red Cross, the European security watchdog and Ukrainian authorities on board. Nearly 300 trucks are now on their way to the border, carrying generators, hundreds of tons of products, including baby food, water, medical supplies and sleeping bags. The Red Cross confirms it's received a detailed list of the aid. Russia's foreign minister says all the details of the deal with Kiev have been ironed out. The movement of the convoy has begun. We got the note confirming Ukraine's readiness to receive this help. On top of that, we took into account all the wishes of the Ukrainian side regarding this operation, including the route that was chosen, even though this means we have to take a large detour. We are relying on the assurances given by the Ukrainians. They guarantee the security of the convoy during its movement through regions controlled by the country's army. We also expect the same attitude from the self-defense forces.